And I've got a little demonstration that I want to show you that I think is kind of fun. The, uh, the coffee industry is $100 billion. So $100 billion uh, every year is spent around the world on coffee. Each one of these gumballs represents $1 billion in annual sales. There's 100 gumballs in here. This is the coffee industry. So Starbucks, if they want to, let's say they're brand new and they're starting out, and they've got this goal to become a billion-dollar company, they need to carve out 1% of that pie. So they would need to have this much of that pie, 1%. So it's really you know, a small percentage of this overall pie. They've been more successful than that. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. They do about eight billion in sales. That's a pretty significant portion of the entire worldwide global sales of coffee. The nutrition industry is 226 billion every year is spent on nutrition. So again, each one of these gumballs represents a billion in sales. So here's the coffee industry. Here's the nutrition industry. And by the way, you may not know this or not, but over half of all the network marketing companies on the planet today, they're nutrition companies. Now let's talk about the travel industry. We need a bigger base here. All right, here's the travel industry. Pretty impressive, right? Well, it doesn't stop there. That's pretty big, right? There's more. <laughs> but wait, there's more. <laughs> and one more. All right, so here's coffee, here's nutrition, the entire nutrition industry, here's travel. <laughs> travel industry is seven trillion dollars every year spent on travel. And they also say that the travel industry is going to grow from $7 trillion to $13 trillion over the next decade. Nutrition and travel.